Alright guys, now we know how to do items, categories, modifier groups, and printer labels. Let's go to the last option on the inventory side of things on the dashboard, which is revenue classes. Revenue classes, this is really, really great for bars and restaurants where it is important to keep track of liquor sales and food sales and what each, uh, each revenue class, so if it's food, what percentage of my total sales for the day, for the week, for the month, from the year are food and what, um, what percentage of my sales are liquor. So I'm going to show you how to set that up now. So we click on revenue classes on the left side and then we click on add revenue class. Now the first thing that it's going to prompt us to do is to put in the revenue class name. Once we put the revenue class name in there, for example, food, let's go back, food, we're going to start assigning items to that. So we're just going to go around and we're going to start clicking around. So we add these items to the food revenue class, now click save. Now that revenue class is set up. So now when you pull up your uh, your end of day report, or if you look at any of your sales reports through Clover, there will be a section added for those revenue classes. So you'll see the percentage of your sales, dollar amount, and the individual amount of sales for each revenue class that you add.